second low down. Keeping it a bill, that ain't no doubt. Much love to the homie, every city know me now. More crowd, pressing issues in the positive. Locked out TV is way better than they thought it is. The interviews is solid facts, talking about your troubled past. What you did, it changed that shit. Doing better is the plan. Homie keeps a solid point. Combo lit just like a joint. And they hit just like a brew. Locked out TV. What's good, fam, bam? Welcome back to another episode of Loked Out TV. You already know how we do it, man. We're going to keep it loked out, no doubt. For real, coming at you with another loked out banger. In this episode right here, we're going to be talking a little bit about Swifty Blue and the latest diss track. But before we jump up into the video, man, I'm going to need y'all to keep it all the way loked out with me. If you haven't hit that subscribe, it'd be highly appreciated if you hit that subscribe, hit that like, and most definitely hit that notification bell. And if you really want to level up in the game, hit that comment section and talk your shh. Because that's exactly what the comment section is there for. So we got Swifty Blue, man. He done dropped a diss track, y'all. He done diss Bozo. He done diss Compa Raider. He done diss King Little G. He done diss Chito Ranas. He done diss Young Drummer Boy. Man. He done diss Bozo. Man. That's Bozo. King Little G. Young Drummer Boy. Chito Ranas, Mr. Criminal. Man. <laughs> Damn. Am I missing one? Am I missing one? I don't I don't know. I I might be missed one, man. I don't know. Uh you know what, man? As far as the diss track goes, and this is what I'm saying, man, to, to rappers, man, that want to make diss tracks. You make diss tracks, bro, they gotta be good. You know what I'm saying? I'll give it to him. It's a good diss track. It's good. It was, it was a dope track. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to flex. I'm not going to talk shit. I thought it was good. A lot of individuals thought it was good. Now, am I going to bang it? Am I going to put it on my playlist? No. But I thought it was good. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I thought the video was straight. It was okay. You know? Uh, and I say that because I've seen a lot of garbage diss tracks. So, I mean, on, on the whole scheme of things, it was okay. What was not good about the diss track is the fact that, for one, you're talking shit about King Little G that slapped you. So, and then and he and this happened a long time ago, like what? What was it, like a year? Anyways, man, it, it was a minute ago, right? And you, <laughs> you don't get no, no nothing, no, no nothing, you know, uh, no get back, but you drop six months to a year later, you drop a diss track calling him a bitch. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, bro. Like, that's weak to me. That's weak. It don't matter. And, and, and that's the thing about it, bro. It don't matter how good the diss track is. If, if, if you get slapped and then you don't even do anything about it, period, at all, nothing, and then a year later, you drop a diss track. Well, that diss track is irrelevant. It's weak. You know what I'm saying? Um, all the individuals talk about realistically are right around the corner from him. You know? Uh, and which I don't know where he's at. I'm on, I am I just know he's from Cali. So being that he's from Cali, and if he's in Cali, then really they're right around the corner from him. You know what I'm saying? But, um... You know who we didn't diss in the diss track, though? Thress. Unless he threw us a, uh, uh, like a slick diss in there. And if he did, let me know. Drop a comment in the comment section. But all them fools he mentioned, he didn't mention Thress. And Thress dissed the hell out that fool. Anyway, just saying. Just ran across my mind. But the point is, man, you cannot drop a diss track dissing everybody, bro. And, and you ain't did nothing. Nothing about anything that was going on at all, period. You you know, no pull ups. And it's one thing to be out of state on a whole nother in a whole nother country, whole other area, whatever the case may be. But you know, if if you're right there, basically right there, right around the corner, and these fools are uh, are causing you these issues and you're feeling some type of way about these fools and you don't ever do anything, period, point blank. But then, like I said, a year later, you drop a diss track. It's clout chasing. It's clout chasing. It's, it's, no, it's no more than that. It's clout chasing. 
At this point, that shit's clout chasing. You know what I'm saying? Especially with King OG, bro. Like, everyone knows that King Lil G slapped that fool. You know, everybody knows that, bro. And 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 then on top of that, another trippy situation about the whole thing is G Face was literally calling that fool a weenie, a bitch, a punk, a lame, all this shit. And then you go and make a diss track with G Face dissing everyone else. I don't know, man. I don't know, man. Y'all drop a comment in the comment section and let me know what y'all think about this situation because I don't know about it. I don't know. I don't know what else to say about it. You know what I'm saying? So that being said, uh, it was an okay diss track, but it's irrelevant. If you ask me, it's irrelevant because you just clout chasing, bro. That's that's a clout chasing diss track right there. You know, um, Bozo done clown the hell out there, fool, for dropping it. You know, uh, <laughs> I don't know, man. I'm just saying, bro. We still waiting on something. You know, we we still waiting on something to happen about actually getting slapped up. You know what I'm saying? But anyways, it is what it is, man. I uh, hope everybody enjoyed the video. Much love, much respect. Hit that subscribe, comment below. You already know how we do it, man. We're going to keep it locked out, no doubt, for real. Till the next one, and I'm out. Locked out TV, thought you knew. Keep it G and keep it fly. Locked out merch, you got.